And you can hear the word of God in this morning. I invited today, invite today, amen, uh, uh, three preachers that are going to be with me today. Tres predicadores que van a estar conmigo hoy. Thank God I didn't have to fly them in from anywhere. Gracias a Dios que no lo tuve que traer de viaje de ningún lado. Amen. Uh, uh, I bless the Lord because we feed them and we clothe them and we give them all that they need. Le di gracias a Dios porque le damos comida y le damos so, ropa. I want, all, I want all my family to take part this morning. Quisiera que toda mi familia cogiera parte Amen. en esta so mañana. So we, we got Justin out of the way. He was the scariest part of it all. Give the Lord a clap for him. Justin is the parte. Justin repeats everything, man. And repeat it all. If you, you, you sit next to him and you start speaking in tongues, he's going to start repeating it. If you sit next to him and he starts speaking in tongues, he's going to start repeating it. And Brother Ish walks around saying, Ama! And, 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 and my son wakes up in the morning and he goes, Daddy, Ama! He starts shaking his head like he's receiving. I'm just thinking, maybe he is receiving the whole thing. He's receiving the whole thing. Amen. But I want to call up to the mic, amen. Uh, 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 our first speaker, we're not going to be lengthy today. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got a time limit. But I'm going to invite my son Christian to come over and be there for the Lord. Christian, to bring up my God bless you. Amen. 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 Bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Today we're going to be focusing under the theme. Vamos a what shatters an ideal family of a Christian? Uh, what shatters the ideal portrait of a Christian family? Que rompe lo ideal de una familia cristiana. Versus what binds the growth of a Christian family? En contra de lo que o oh, lo que apunta la familia cristiana. Please open with me to Genesis chapter 37 verses 4. Abrimos la Biblia en Génesis capítulo 37. We all stand for the reverence of the Lord. When you have it, please respond with an amen. Cuando lo tengan, pueden decir amen. The word reads in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. En nombre del Padre y del Espíritu Santo. Amen. But when his brothers saw that their father loved him more than all his brothers, they hated him and could not speak peaceably to him. Y viendo sus hermanos que su padre lo amaba más que a todos sus hermanos, le aborrecían y no podían hablarle pacíficamente. Now Joseph had a dream and he told it to his brothers and they hated him even more. Y soñó José un sueño y lo contó a sus hermanos y ellos llegaron a aborrecerle más todavía. So he said to them, please hear this dream which I have dreamed. Y él les dijo, oíd ahora este sueño que he soñado. There were binding sheaves in the field, then behold, my sheep arose, and also stood upright. And indeed your sheep stood all around and bowed down to my sheep. Y que vuestros hermanos estaban alrededor y se inclinaban al mío. Se pueden sentar. This morning I'll be focusing under the sub theme. Resentment versus love. Nos uh, enfocaremos bajo el tema, el subtema aborre aborrecimiento en contra del amor. Resentment is a very meaningful word. It has multiple meanings in it. El aborrecimiento tiene diferentes significados. It regards to feelings. Se, se tiene que ver con sentimientos. Injury. Con dolor. And emotional hurt. Y dolor emocional. It is the feeling of displeasure. Ese sentimiento de sentirse en, a, en algo and it may cause to death. y puede causar muerte. Love, on the other hand, el amor, en otra manera, is a profoundly tender, es algo suave, profundo, passionate affection, apasionante, afeccionado, towards one thing, hacia algo one person. o una persona. As I began preparing the sermon, I prayed to the Almighty Father, Jehovah Jireh, the provider of knowledge and understanding. As my prayer ceased, God put in my heart the name Joseph. Joseph is known as the suffering servant, who went from being pushed down by jealous brothers 
que fue de ser empujado por el mano que ahora es brought up to be the right hand of a king y levantado a ser la mano derecha del rey Genesis chapter 37 verse 3 Genesis capítulo 37 versículo 3 tells us that Joseph was Jacob's most loved son nos dice que José fue el hijo más amado por and, Jacob and from the dreams he had y los sueños que él tuvo it was clear that one day he would be ruling over his brothers era claro que un día él iba a estar sobre sus hermanos and for this they hated him y por eso lo aborrecían in my opinion en mi opinión I have to tell the truth tengo que decir la verdad I would resent yo lo aborrecería también. Why would God put my brother Porque Dios pondría a mi hermano when he sees me worshiping him as well. cuando me ve a mí adorando también. Because of jealousy and resentment, Por el celo y el aborrecimiento, Joseph's brothers conspired to kill him. los hermanos de José se juntaron para matarlo. The hatred and anger reached its peak. El odio y el contra él. And Joseph was sold by 20 measly pieces of silver. Y lo vendieron por 20 pedazos de plata. While, jo what Joseph, while Joseph didn't understand it, God had other plans for him. Yes. Tenía otro plan para él. After being betrayed by his brothers and led to Egypt, sido por sus hermanos y llevado a Egipto, Joseph soon finds himself being at the right hand of Pharaoh. José se encuentra en la mano derecha del faraón. He also finds himself being accused of a crime he didn't commit. Y también lo acusaron por un crimen que no hizo. The slander and lies presented led to Joseph being in prison. Las mentiras que le presentaron lo echaron en la en la cárcel. He had no say in the matter even though No tenía nada que decir. He was innocent. Aunque era inocente. Joseph went from being condemned. José fue a ser condenado. In prison. En prisión. To being exalted. A ser exaltado. How great God is. Qué grande es Dios. Apart from Pharaoh, there was no one above Joseph. Además de Faraón, no había alguien más mayor que José. A great famine had reached over the land where Joseph's brothers had dwelt. Una hambre vino a la tierra donde estaban los hermanos de José. They came to Joseph seeking provision. Vinieron a donde José buscando provisión. On their first visit, they didn't recognize Joseph. En su primera visita no reconocieron a José. But the second visit, they recognized visit, Joseph. Pero la visita, During that visit, Durante esa visita, all broke, all of the brothers, todos los hermanos, had broken their chain of resentment se habían, se habían su that was upon their lives and actually learned y aprendieron the true meaning of love. La, el conocimiento del amor. You see, church, God doesn't want our families being filled with resentment, jealousy, and anger. Dios no quiere que nuestras familias sean llenas de aborrecimiento, celos y ira. But perhaps being filled by the unconditional love that Jehovah Jireh provides. Pero llenando de un amor incondicional que Dios da. As a member of your family, como miembro de tu familia, take a step. And, un paso. and try to fill your household y trata de llenar tu familia with that unconditional love that Jehovah es, Jireh provides. Con ese amor incondicional que da Dios. Resentment versus love. Ar aborrecimiento contra amor. Love conquers all. El amor lo puede yes. todo. However, Pero, resentment leads to grudges. Abor abor aborrecimiento lleva a grudges. And love <laughs> Y amor leads to forgiveness. Lleva a perdón. Dios le bendiga, hermanos. Predicaron bajo el subtema aborrecimiento en contra de 